Welcome back to another video on my channel. Today's video is going to be a video that I have not done before. I've seen a lot of comments in my recent videos. A lot of people have been DMing me on Instagram to do a bike check video. So that is what today's video is going to be. We've got James and Johnny up there. You can't really see them. But we're going to do a little bike check video of my bike. Maybe James is not sure yet. And then after that, just going to keep the camera rolling, get a couple clips of us all. So yeah, I'm gonna go into the bike check right now. So one question I've been asked a lot recently is, what tires do I have? So these are the tires I have on my bike. Fix lips. The place I got them from is Chain Reaction Cycles. I'm gonna put the link right there. So another question is, what seat do I have? This seat, as you can see, is proper messed up. This is a SEC, it is on a it's off a big ripper it's one of the old model rippers but yeah this is the seat i have se seat these seats obviously come off se bikes so i don't think you can buy them individually you might be able to find some on ebay or if you have a ripper know anyone has a ripper they might be selling a seat but that is what my seat is so as you can see my whole gear and setup is slx Selects crank, cassette, derailleur, front derailleur. At the time I bought SLX because I have a SLX brake, but I have a different brake now and we're gonna go on to what brake that is in a minute. But you can also buy this buy this whole set off chain reaction cycles. That is where I buy most of my items for my bike, most of my things for my bike. So yeah, you can get them off chain reaction cycles. Another major question are my thoughts. These forks are Rock Shop Recons. So as you can see there, these Rock Shop Recon forks have a travel of 120 mil, which is quite a lot. As you can see here, that is the size of them. They're quite spongy, they're air forks. So if you take this dust cap off, you can put air into there. But to do that, you do need a special pump. You can also buy these forks off chain reaction cycles again. As I said, that is where I get most of my bike parts from. If you see any bike parts on this video that you like, make sure you go over to the website and just have a look through, see if you see anything you like. But yeah, that are my rock shops. So another big question that I have been getting asked recently is, what bike do I have? I have a specialized frame. It's a specialized hard rock. Let me come on here, sorry. A specialized hard rock frame as you can see there I don't think these bikes you can get anymore this is a 2014 model specialized hard rock I don't think any shops sell this bike anymore so I'm lucky to have it really but there might be some on eBay but all I'm saying is they're rare to find but if you do find one then I guess lucky you but yeah that is what bike I have now moving on to the pedals these pedals are very worn out these are called DMRs, they're still going strong, a couple scratches, all the paint has been pretty much chipped off. It's gone through a lot of these pedals, but these pedals are DMR V8s. Yeah, again, you can find them on Chain Reaction Cycles. So if you like the look of them pedals, make sure you go over there and grab a pair. Now moving on to my brake, as you can see, I have the XT. If you're wondering what that scratch is there, all I'm saying is ask Jake, he dropped my bike but this brake is the XT one finger brake. I've run the cable down here all the way to the back where the caliper is sitting. The next thing are my grips. These grips are ODI grips. They're ODI long neck red grips. If you like the look of these, when you buy these, it comes with one of these. Well, oh, actually it comes with two of these, which are bar ends. So if you do drop your bike, obviously the bars don't get scratched, it just hits that bit there. I've got one on the other side as well. It's pretty mashed up. But those are my grips, ODI long necks in red. Now moving on to my bars. As you can see, I've got Renful, fat bars. I get asked this question a lot, what bars do I have? 
what are the width and things like that so what we're going to do we're going to check right now I'm not sure if you can see that but the length of my bars are 700 mil so these bars do not come 700 mil stock they come with an extra 20 mil on each side so about 740 I'm not too sure you're going to have to check but it is about 740 mil I cut these down because personally they were too long for me but now I've cut them down to the right size and they fit me perfect so they're the Renful Fat Bars. You can also get these on Chain Reaction Cycles. I think they've reduced the price now to maybe £50. So yeah. Now moving on to my wheels. I have Halo T2 rims. If you're wondering, my wheels are customised. So I've got the Halo rims with the red Pro Evo 4 hub. So as I said, because these wheels are customised, you cannot just pick these up from the shop how mine are i got mine fully customized with the black spokes with the rim hub everything so you can't actually buy these wheels straight from the shop how mine are because my wheels are customized so what you'd have to do you'd have to go to your local shop and ask them if they do a custom wheel build you just tell them what spokes you want what what rim you want what hub you want and they should be able to sort something out so that's how i got mine done if you're wondering now Last but not least, what I've been asked a lot is where I get my stickers from. This is where I get my stickers from. Be seen in Reflex. So if you DM them on Instagram, which I'm going to put right there, you tell them what stickers you want, how you want them to look, the size, the font, the colour, anything. They'll get it sorted for you. As you can see here, I've got my custom logo. That is me right there like i've got on one of my reflex t-shirts but that is what stickers i have on my bike so be seen in reflex instagram there go check them out if you want the custom reflex stickers i'm going to show you what they look like now in the dark so this is what the bike looks like when it's reflecting with the light on so that is my bike check complete i hope you like this video but don't go yet because this video has not ended yet. We're going to be getting some riding clips with me and James. So stay tuned in this video to see some progress from me and James. So yeah, hope you enjoy.
So that is going to be a wrap on today's video. Remember, if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new. Make sure you turn the post notifications on and I'll see you in the next video.